card, any card. Can I pick the Queen of Diamonds? No, no, I mean, physically remove a card from the deck. But why? It's a trick. Well, why would I want to be tricked? Because it's magic, and magic is fun. Oh, here, Simon, pick a card, any card. Oh, thank you not to exploit my lack of proper appendage. Okay, cry, cry, it's okay, I'll, I'll, I'll pick a card. Okay, take one. Now, don't let me see it, look at it. Now, I want you to show your card to the audience. Don't let me see it. Okay, now, I want everybody out there in TV land to think of the Waitron's card. Think of the Waitron's card. Wait a minute. I think I'm getting something. Yes, yes, I'm definitely getting something. The viewers are sending me their thoughts. They think the show sucks? No! They're telling me that the Waitron's card is... The Eight of Hearts. I don't believe it. Holy shit, Ellen, you actually guessed right. How the hell did you do that? Well, it is a little known fact that 90% of the reptilian subbrain, otherwise known as the Reptilicus thalamus, is entirely devoted to card tricks. You know that T-Rex? Little tiny arms, but boy, could he ever shuffle. The thalamus reptilicus entirely devoted to card tricks, huh? Um. Welcome to the Space Bar, everybody. Uh, tonight's crypt episode is about an unscrupulous magician who uses dastardly techniques to steal tricks from other magicians. Billy Zane and Martin Sheen star in Well-Cooked Hams. And don't forget to stick around for tonight's Space Bar feature, TC2000. But right now, it's Well-Cooked Hams from the Crypt on your Space Bar. You got any other tricks, clam face? Um, pull my finger. No way. What's got into you tonight? Well, like I said, pull my finger. Piss off. So, Alien, I hope you've learned your lesson about screwing around with other people's magic tricks. I'm not such a bad magician. Grot, stacking the deck does not make you a good magician. Well, I'll have you know, I can do lots of other tricks. Yeah, like what? Well, I can make you disappear. Ooh, I like that one. Now. Can you sew yourself in half? You're such a cut-up, Simon. Stick around, everybody. TC2000 is up soon. So, are we gonna start the movie or what? Yeah, I'm just feeling a little guilty. What the hell for? Well, I probably shouldn't have turned off the Waitron like that. Oh, why the hell not? It's a lot quieter around here without her. How would you like it if I turned you off for a joke? Besides, she's the only one of us that ever gets any fan mail. Well, there's uh, no accounting for taste. And one, and two. Pull it down, and three. What in the Keep tarnation the is she doing? And one. I hope there's not a glitch in her program. And three. She's probably and researching four. tonight's and movie. Switch. Hey, and Waitron. Uh, and down. What you doing? Uh, I'm researching tonight's movie. And How three. How do you know? She's doing Keep Tai Bo. Tonight's movie stars Mr. And tai Bo himself, and two. Billy Blanks. And switch. What and the now. devil is Tai Bo? Uh, it's exercise, Grot. I wanted to experiment with how real people keep in shape. And up. Uh, but you're a hologram. And Maybe uh, she thinks she's a fat hologram. Watch it, mister. I'm not getting in the middle of this. Tonight's space bar feature is TC2000. It's about a future where the atmosphere is so polluted that the rich people live underground and the poor people are forced to live on the surface. And they kick the stuffing out of each other for the right to survive. It's not so much a sci-fi movie as it is a chop sake flick. Billy Blanks and Bobby Phillips star in TC2000, shot in Toronto and Mississauga, Ontario. So, Waitron, uh, tell me about this Thai bow. And well, Have fun, be strong, and punch in two and three. Oh. Wow, that Billy Blank sure knows how to kick some ass. I wonder how he does it. He works out, Grot. He's a seventh degree black belt in Taekwondo and holds black belts in five other martial arts disciplines. You know, you should try working out, Grot. It's good for you. Huh, no way. <laughs> Such a lazy son of a bitch. Hey! We work out on Grot's planet, it's just a little different. I could put this thumb through concrete. What? Yeah, 
People on Grot's planet like work out 16 hours a day with their thumbs watching old reruns. We go through remotes faster than Joan Collins goes through old husbands. Hmm. Thought you spent most of your time with your thumb up your ass. Hey! All right, fine. Anything the Waitron can do, I can do better. Let's go. That's the spirit, Grot. Now remember, you want to get that heart rate pumping. Okay. So one, and two, and three, and punch, and two, and punch, and... Oh. Uh, um, Grot? Are you okay? Change the channel, Mommy. I doing this? Oh, come on, Grot. Don't you want to be ripped? Thank you, no! Oh, no. I meant, don't you want to be ripply and muscly like Billy Blanks? Hey, speaking of ripped, am I the only one still watching this movie? It's a total ripoff of Robocop, Blade Runner, and Demolition Man. Yeah, but Bobby Phillips was a lot easier on the eyes than Peter Weller was in Robocop. Jab, jab, jab. Come on, Grot. Jab, jab. Come on, Grot. Come on, Jack. Come on, Grot. Come on, Jack. Oh. Um, is he on the floor again? Yeah. But I didn't hit him this time. Oh, too bad. Would you mind kicking him while he's down? And one, and two, and one. Finished jumping around like an idiot? I was not jumping around like an idiot. I was experimenting with exercise. I can see how it makes corporeal beings feel better. It's very invigorating. I don't think Clownface would agree with you. Anyway, where is old Thumbs of Steel? Oh. 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 Grot. Uh. Are you okay? I think I pulled a muscle. The one between your ears? No. Oh, I think I sprained a giblet. Oh, that ain't good. Oh, I think I'm gonna be maimed for life. I've always thought that. Uh, so, Grot, uh, are you gonna make working out part of your daily routine? The only thing I'm going to be working out from now on is what movie to show on Friday nights. Oh, this is painful. Tell me about it. Oh, I wish I'd never, ever heard of Mr. Blanks. <laughs> I'll bet that's what Billy's mom thought about his dad. What do you mean? Well, he was the fourth of 15 children. <laughs> Talk about giving a girl a workout. <laughs> sure looks like Billy's dad wasn't shooting Blanks. <laughs> <laughs> See you next time on the Space Bar, everybody. I think maybe I should try doing Yoda. I think you'll get your face slapped. And that's yoga, Grot. Oh. <laughs>